broadcasting from the front lines of the info war. Eddie El Dorado from the Hank Cow News Network, somewhere in El Dorado County. Yes, indeed, the Patriots have taken back the base. Now, the fake news matrix of your mind that they have created for you, they have told you that transsexuals and homosexuals are everywhere. Well, I beg to differ. In all the small rural communities around the United States, I don't see any, do you? Very few. In fact, there's one-tenth of one percent of the population is transsexual. But if you watch the uh, national news networks, they would have you believe they're everywhere, and they're not. That's another fake news matrix of your mind. Now, the UN corporate global war What they did in World War I and World War II was they split up Europe into economic zones on purpose to move vast populations of people from war zones to economic zones. They're doing the same thing here in Venezuela and all the South American countries and that's why we're seeing an influx of illegal aliens all over the United States, especially here in California. They're doing it on purpose. These illegal aliens that are coming across our border, it is an invasion, and they're doing it on purpose. Now, these kids are taken away from the children and the parents. I think they're being treated better than most of our homeless veterans. I mean, look at the facilities they're being put into. If our homeless vets were taken care of like that, we'd have no problem, right? Now on my other broadcast, I called for a million men. Well, there's a, already three million militia members in the Republic of Jefferson, all up and down the West Coast. Look what happened at the Bundy Ranch. Look what happened with the standoff in Oregon. There are millions of us out there. There are 40 million militia members all over the United States. And why did I say bring your guns and your weapons? Not to fight the National Guard, not to fight the government, absolutely not. But the illegal alien gangs that are coming across the border, like MS-13, and who knows who else is coming over the border, from Pakistan, Afghanistan, Syria, Iraq, they found an easy way to sneak in to our country. Now are they soldiers? Are they loyal to the caliphate? You have to ask yourself that question. So yeah, if you're coming out here, you bring your weapons. AKs, AR-15s, whatever you got, man. You bring your squirrel gun, I don't care. But the whole idea is to keep your community safe from these kind of predators. Think about it. Every county, all up and down the west coast, is a garrison. That's right, a military outpost fitted out with volunteer militia members. And if these guys start attacking our schools, our neighborhoods, our communities, hey, we're going to shoot back. That's right. You bring your weapons out here, bring a lot of ammo, because there might be a fight. And we're fighting the MS-13 gangs. Sections of Arizona are too dangerous that they pulled back the National Guard. They pulled back the Border Patrol because the drug gangs are taking over the whole area. Well, we're not going to let them do that. We're going to fight back. 
So, this is a call for all volunteer militia to organize yourself into companies, choose your own captains, your own leaders, and put together your own fields of fire wherever you are in your own neighborhood. Is that clear? Now this will also serve as a proclamation declaration of the Republic of Jefferson. YouTube goes worldwide. We are declaring a Republic of Jefferson, a sovereign state. This is an emergency interim government that will decide what happens in the Republic of Jefferson. Okay, this is a notice to Jerry Brown and the state of California, a declaration of independence right before the 4th of July. We've had it with your socialist agitation, so the sovereign citizens are going to take over. The sovereign state, the SS versus the SA. Exactly, with a different meaning this time, boys. You are not going to rule us the way you have been. That is a fact. There is more of us than there is of you. And if you come after us with the MSN, MS gangs, MS-13 gangs, yeah, we know about your agent provocateurs, anti-fa, anti-fascist, well, you're the fascist, man, you're, you guys are the Nazis, Maxine Waters, yeah, you're calling for agitation, well, you're gonna kick over a beehive, man, we all got freaking weapons, and we know how to use them, and we're gonna train our neighborhoods, and our brothers, and our sisters on how to shoot, no kidding. You want to start some bullshit? Well, yeah, okay. Bring it on. Bring it on, Antifa. Bring it on, MS-13. Yeah. You kicked over the wrong beehive, man. You're going to find out we're a swarm of hornets, and we're coming after you if you start shit. You got that? So Homeland Security, FBI, whoever's watching this program, my meaning of bringing your weapons out here is to protect ourselves from thug gangs. Not the government. Not the National Guard. Okay? 